<sighs> hey yo, this is a Tuesday toy photography tutorial. We are going to talk about props and setup. Sorry if I sound funnier than normal. I either have really bad allergies or a tiny cold of some sort. This will be a quick and easy tutorial and hopefully it can spark some ideas for your photos. As an example, we're gonna use my most recent shot with General Grievous and Kenobi fighting. So let's go. So this shot was actually a request over on TikTok. But here's the setup that we have. I already have the main characters in play. I pretty much always work with the subjects first and then worry about the background and props after. I definitely need to make some new background pieces, but for now we're gonna use our desert buildings and this will be a desert city battle. I'm gonna set these up. For this shot, it doesn't matter how they look. It's not really a part of the story. It's just kind of setting the location and that they look like they're buildings or structures. On to the props. I bought these 3D prints on Etsy and they were really well made. I'll post a link in the bio to the store and they were also easy to paint and I had, I had fun painting them. So before putting these in, this is the shot that we have without anything. So it looks pretty good but it could be better. And because I don't have too many props like these and I've only had these for like a few weeks painted, I'm kind of a noob at actually using them, but I'm pretty good at making stuff work. I think it's good to set them all up how you think they look good. And then you can look into your camera and see how they come out. And then if you need to rearrange, you can. So you set it up, come to the camera, see what's in frame, move the pieces and then repeat. So what do you do if you don't have these 3D prints? Just buy some. Just kidding. One way is making them. This isn't really a technical prop, but it's just a PVC pipe. It was the one that I made in that diorama video last month. Like the wall could still be a wall without this, but just add this, adds a little texture and difference into the image. But yes, sticks could still work as like debris and stuff, but you could get a bigger stick and use it as like a log. I really like this guy. I've used it for like a handful of shots. Another real example that's mostly free, rocks. Like I really like this rock, but just make sure you get cool rocks. Don't just get some random rock and like, oh look, it's, it's texture. Remember, this is all about making your set look interesting. So another thing you can add to your setup is other figures kind of putting them in the background or on the foreground or on the floor and just help tell the story that you're showing. General Grievous and Kenobi, it could easily just be them two fighting. That's it. But put Cody in the background, put a couple droids in there too. Boom, it's like an actual scene, not just a shot. So we went from this to this. Let me know if you have any other requests for tutorials or shot ideas, you can put those in the comments. Hope this inspires you to go shoot and make your photos pop more. Go create and inspire. I'll see you on the internet. Peace.